Yeah. All right, I'm gonna f- I'm gonna divide up teams here. Okay. okay. Who's the most competitive on, of the Shakers? Nick. Okay, yeah. so we got Except you for on Ro one team. When being asked about who's the most competitive. We got. <laughs> uh, okay, so we got. I just want to be like him. We got Ro. We got, we got we got Ro on team one. We got That's right, uh, number one. We got Nick on team two. Now um, Harry Pockets. We were, we were talking. Harry Pockets you know, broke up. The music. The music <laughs> today. You know, we were talking about the hook. Mm. Trouble. Yeah. Somebody's somebody's trouble. Between the two of you, who's the most trouble? That oh my guy. god! Without a question. That guy. Yeah. Totally. All right, you're with Ro. <laughs> yeah. yeah All right, so here's the team. Oh, yeah, I'm, okay. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. We had a debate on the song title of the of this yes. of this track. Yeah. Yes. That we're gonna hear right now. Yes. So give you, us the story. Uh, it's well, the story of the song. The song is the strong, strong sharp creature. Strong sharp creature. Which is, if you say it ten times fast, you get into their shows strong, for free. Strong sharp creature. Strong, strong, creature. Strong, 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 Uh, but yeah, when when fans ask for it, they're like, oh, play the, play the Here Comes Trouble song. And you're like, they, like what? Here <laughs> Comes Trouble. Tr- what, what are you talking about? <laughs> Do you even know us? No, so, okay, so you guys are the trouble in the band. In what, in, Chris, in what way are you trouble? I, I talk a lot. Uh, I like to crack jokes. I yeah. like to make inappropriate comments. I like inappropriate humor. Um, I, uh... Next, Jody. Why are you? I, <laughs> Jody, where are you I trouble? I am never. I am never trouble. I'm really. I'm always easygoing until you push my buttons too far, and then tall cock t- comes out. Yeah. And what's my, what's my, a button? My what's Nick, your biggest button? Oh, if I, I guess, if if I feel like, if if I feel like someone's not making good on their promises, if someone's kind of. Uh, you know, getting in the way of my bandmates here. I get really kind of maternal and uh, and and weird and loud and annoying, and I turn into Talcock. She can also be trouble with uh, with long car rides that are like six to eight hours long, every fifteen to twenty minutes, needing to potty for for a potty break. Yeah. It, you have pretty, to hydrate when you're on your way to a show. You have to hydrate, and I'm not going to stop doing that. You should stop drinking beer in the car. <laughs> See, that's that's. That's what we're talking about. I am not. When you occupy my mind, I don't feel so all alone. It's like a great. Here comes trouble. Here comes trouble. Ooh, hit your car. I'm
Okay, ladies first. Jody, you'll right. uh, send the target ball out. Underhanded, right? I can do uh, it for any way. Please. And oh, real quick, house rules. You have to throw with your feet on the tiles, all right? And uh, I told you about getting the white paw past the second tree from your side. And no, those weren't planted. Those were already here. I built around them. What happens if you don't get the ball across as a penalty, or you just have to throw it again? Uh, you got to throw it again. Yeah, you want to try to get it out because uh, short game's boring. And then, um, oh, and it's uh, minus two points if you happen to throw the ball outside the, the thing. And if you have the white ball and your ball kissing, touching, it's three points. Every other thing is closest to for one point.
listen to the Shakers music and there's kind of that like sensual, sexual undertones. What's the, what's the, who's the source of that? I feel like it's both of us. I feel like because both of us write lyrics and like there'll be one song. Nice shot. Nice. Uh, you know, there'll be, there'll be one song from Chris. Like, like he, like he wrote the lyrics to I Spy, which is one of the, yeah, definitely one of the most sensual songs we have. Well done, Nick. Well done. Um, but the other song we did, Low Lights, that song, I wrote that about a little experience doing I had laundry. in high doing laundry <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. on spring break. Yeah. And uh, that's, what, uh, that's what that one's about. <laughs> but like, do you think your, your creativity comes from like a, like a sensual, sexual place? Or is it more from like, is it more from the abstract and, and just random life like you were talking about being on spring break? I mean, Chris, you For too. For me, like, it changes it... song by song. Yeah. I, I, I you know, I, I write what I'm feeling. So if I'm, if I'm feeling sexy, I'll write sexy. Mm. Yeah. Um, but, you know, I think life just... Well, you wrote a song about your dog and his bum knee. I did. I mean, how cool is that? That was that was more money than any Shaker song has ever made. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, I mean, it's true. everybody... everybody <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you need to break a leg. Yeah. Yeah. Right about it. Like Dave I'll Grohl. I'll take one for the team. You've been in the studio. You've been recording. You did the amazing shapeshifter thing yes. a couple months back. Yes. Which, if you guys didn't hear about this, it was an aerial performance uh, set to their music. Unbelievable, mind-blowing experience. Mind-blowing. You've done it two years in a row. Yes. Uh, shapeshifter, you can Google it. I mean, shapeshiftercircus.com. You can there, find yeah. out some more information. I, I hope, we hope that, uh, you know, we're still trying to plot more opportunities for it because it's a unique show. It's yeah, a very and it's, show. It, you can't even really describe it because it doesn't do it justice. I mean, you could go to a million rock shows and you will have never seen anything like this. Let's just put it that way. Yeah, that's true. That's, I, that was one of the things that kind of like freaked me out about it was just like, it's like no band in history has ever done this like yeah. it's so it's so cool like basically to have like this incredible artist take your album and create this aerial display <laughs> and be like will you guys play your album live while all of these incredibly talented acrobatics like just do impossible feats yeah, just it's unbelievable. inches from the audience's head and there's a story and it all ties in it's just like yeah, and it's like Cirque du Soleil meets Epic Rock. Yeah, and you guys, yeah, right, well put, amazing actually. songs and, <laughs> and perform incredibly well. All well. things Shakers can be found at at I love the Shakers dot com. Yes, all things, all updates, all things can be found online anywhere really, yeah. but yeah, especially and, there. Yeah, uh, Rescue Team you can find on iTunes, Pandora. Everywhere, Spotify, you can vinyl. Find, yes, on vinyl. I, you yeah. come and visit us. We got we got some stuff for you. Um, but yeah, the next the EP, uh, Strong Sharp Creature, is coming out in August. And the last track we're hearing today, I love, I Spy. I Spy. Yes, that is from Rescue Team. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, we love we love that track. It's kind of it's just different. It's different to kind of do that, you know, because we're a rock band, but we also play this really. Kind of almost dusty Springfield kind of yeah soulful Set back a little bit yeah yeah it's like that sexy soulful one of those tracks you can just get lost in.
Let's finish this game. I want to see this. Right. Wait, we got uh, what's the count now? Oh. Well, they just got what two uh, more it's points? Nine one. It's nine nine to one. one. Nine to one. Now you got it's it. Now did you get it? Did you hear it? Everyone, you get on the score. It's <laughs> Eleven, nine but hey, to one. But let's not get cocky just yet because it's true. Very easy to come back in this game, and if you go uh, eleven wins, playing to eleven. But if you go over eleven, you go back to seven. <gasps> oh, oh, that's awesome! I'm so, excited. More I'm house excited. rules for you. Nice. Woo. Keeping right. them guessing. Let's play dirty. Hey, parents of drummers always seem like the coolest parents around because it, there's so much. I mean, when can you do it where it's not bothering somebody? My my parents are, are Ma- pretty cool. Mama yeah. and Papa Woods are, are pretty dope. I mean, nice. Pretty I dope. Where'd you grow up? Uh, a few places. Um, I was born in Santa Monica, uh, lived in Telluride, Colorado for s- seven, eight years, and then the Bay Area, and then uh, graduated high school in Prescott, Arizona. Oh, journeyman. Yeah. Journeyman. I, it, and it's funny, because I was actually the same way. I I wouldn't call myself a jock. I dabbled in sports in, in middle school, did you know track, cro- uh, cross country, uh, basketball. A little bit of soccer when I was a little kid, but I was actually a golfer, and that's where I got really? my still play? competitive spirit. I still play. No! Yes. Golf is probably one of the most competitive sports because you're just yourself. It's like yeah, bowling actually. <laughs> I, I bowled a lot as a kid. Never like with my own ball, but that was always my birthday party. There, here you go. This is why you're so good at bocce. Oh, except that we're not. Really doing that great. <laughs> well, it's a game of chance, really. I'll be honest. So, it, both athletes. When did, did you? Did you guys still get out and play? You still play golf? You still get out and play? I any still hoops play golf. It's it's time consuming and expensive, so yeah, it's not. It's not I don't go very often. Uh, it's a good way to ruin your day, too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you can have a bad day on the course, and you're just bitter yeah. for the rest of the day. Yeah, he it's comes like... home and he hits me! <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I also didn't... I, always, I I played a little bit of drums here and there as a, as a kid, but I didn't really get into really going for it until I was about 17. Mid-game conference here! Billy Martin, we got, going, we got to Billy close Martin our going mouth to the mound. So can't to talk to his pitcher. Try to figure out how you to get some points. Three, in order to <laughs> catch up, each one of the balls needs to touch the, the, the white ball. You need four balls. Jody Jason. knows something about what balls need to touch. The best thing about Jody bocce are the endless video I have a plan. <laughs> I have a plan. All right, this is the big moment. Jody <laughs> reels back, nearly threw it off. Oh, the wow, they got and 12. Here, they lost. And here we go, Nick. And Jody, sharp, strong creatures, have won. <laughs> Thanks, you guys. This was so fun. Today. Yes. <laughs> Good times hanging out. Thank you. Yeah. It was a lot of fun until I got to go home feeling like a loser. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, oh, he's upset. He's upset. Good game. Good game. That was fun, man. It was. Yeah. It was. Thank you. Good game, bro. Good, good game, fucker. <laughs> <laughs>